Welcome to Walking in the Woods with me, not really foraging, but foraying and seeing what all we can find and identify. I thought this would be a really fun video to take you guys along with me on this journey because this is often something that I love to do like once a week. So I figured I would bring you along. In the forest on in rainy day, in rainy day. I just think that you know, this is the perfect time to find mushrooms because it's raining. Even though it's been really wet. I feel like some reishi have to be popping out. Kind of. Oh, there's some over there. That was a stopping All the pretty little it's interesting because they have like a a porous kind of bottom it's not yeah and they're like purple on top what kind of tree is this dead it's a dead tree i know it's just bark Oh yeah. Yeah. It was very wet back there. <laughs> but I think that's Oh, that's a cute little baby. It's nice to have this. We can't miss our turn off, you know. Is that it? Right there? Or it's blocked. It's honestly, I mean, yeah, it's very minimal. I think that it's honestly better this way because less people are, you know, coming out here. No, this is it. Yeah, it's it like just, it just, right here. They just... Uh, should I try and take a look at the radar and see if this will pass or... How 
shake your head. That's some freaking crazy frog poop in it. It seems to have like stopped raining now. <laughs> but I think this is getting like taken over by something else. You missed this little red baby right here next to all of them. There are a couple places that we normally go to try and find mushrooms and just look around to see what's growing. So we checked out a couple spots and we did find some different mushrooms in each spot, which was really nice. All these areas are really close by to where we live. So in like Cumberland County is where I will say for now. <laughs> okay, so there's, this is like a little patch of them. There's more over there. And just some rash. Mm -hmm. We'll have to come back and see. Maybe it turns into just this little pool. Ooh. But what I saw was these are like jack o' lanterns. Look at look at this big ass. Yeah, those are cool.
Mm hmm. Yeah. Good spot. Good spot for streaming. Mm. After our long foray, it was time for a cookout at Griffin's parents' home, which is so nice because we get to be around the animals, poopy here. And it was nice because after a long walk like that, you need to fuel yourself. And that is what we did. It's actually 4th of July, so that is why we were so festive. We enjoyed the evening together and just spending time with one another. Thank you so much for being here and watching. See you next time.